we have another interesting question that we're going to be solving 16 all over 25 all raised to the power of 3 all over 2 and we're not going to be using a calculator so we're going to be using some basic laws in mathematics to solve this question for example the first one we're going to be using will be the law of indices for example when i have a all over b all raised to the power of n the law of indices allows us to write a to this power of n all over and also write b to the same power of n and that is what we're going to be doing to what we have here that means i can write 16 to the power of 3 over 2 all over i can also write 25 to the same power of 3 over 2 that is it now we can even simplify further maybe by saying that 16 16 is same as 4 squared good and this is raised to the same power of 3 over 2 we can simplify 25 as well 25 is same as 5 squared remember it's raised to the power of 3 over 2 now we're going to be using another law, law of indices to be precise. The law of indices that says that when I have, for example, a to the power of m, and this is raised to the power of n, the law of indices says this a, which is the base, can be written the same way, but we have to multiply the powers, like m times n, so that we have a to the power of m times m is mn. Now let's apply the same logic here. That means this can be 4 to the power of 2 times 3 over 2. All over, we're going to be doing the same thing to the denominator. This will be 5 to the power of 2 times 3 over 2. Good. Now as we multiply, this 2 here cancels out this 2. So we are left with 4 to the power of 3. All over now this 2 here cancels out this 2 and we're left with 5 to the power of 3 4 to the power of 3 obviously is equal to 64 why 5 to the power of 3 is obviously 125 so 64 all over 125 is the answer to 16 all over 25 all raised to the power of 3 over 2. Well, if you have any faster way to solve this question, you can show that in the comment section below. And if you enjoyed this video and have learned something from this video, go ahead and give this video a thumbs up, subscribe if you haven't, turn on the notification bell so you don't miss my upcoming videos. And like I always say, until next time, take care.